Okay, we have a air velocity meter TA410 from Airflow Instruments. This is a basic air velocity meter with temperature readout. There is one on-off button over here. So by pressing the on-off button, it would turn the instruments on. And immediately you would see battery indicator showing full bar as well as temperature, degrees Celsius, and the option to look at meters per second. So if I press this meter per, sec per second button, it would go straight to meters per second. Right now, because the probe is inside the, the sleeve, I will have to remove the, the probe to, to, to fan it to show some reading of air velocity. Now, as the, as the, as the air stream passes through the sensor, it will indicate the, the velocity, air velocity. The button on the right hand side over here is, to, is a hole function. So if I were to press onto the hole function, as you can see, the display is freeze. So it's holding onto the, the measurements for us to take a closer look. Now, if I remove the whole function, the instruments will go back to reading in real time. To change from meters per second, there is a button on the left hand side. I can press this button and hold onto it. it in a short while, it will allow me to change between meters per second to feet per minute. So I can go up and select feet per minute or remain at meters per second and select it. So right now I have it in meters per second. Pressing this button here will change it to back to degrees Celsius. Again, if I want to hold onto this button on the left hand side and wait for the selector to, to appear, I can choose between degrees felt degrees Fahrenheit or degrees Celsius. And in this case I'll choose it to be degrees Celsius. To turn it off, I press this button and hold it. It will count down and turn off in about two seconds. These instruments make use of four pieces of double A size batteries. So this is how we remove and put it back. Thank you.